down because that bison was there. But when there's, <laughs> it likes to be near that. Uh, it likes that edge right there. Why is that person? person in the van behind me had their hand like on the glass window like this. In 500 feet, turn left onto side and Stricker Road through ramp. Another interesting question a lot of people are asking is, so, you know, I think this is showing that it's one step closer to uh, more wide release because mm -hmm. they want it to look polished and right. not that developer view. Right. So the question is, now stay straight to take how much would you pay? You know, I paid for this ramp. lump sum when I bought my car. Mm -hmm. But the question is, how much would you pay for this for a, a, a subscription? Yeah. And a lot of people have been guessing how much it's going to cost. a month is what I like a lot of people think. <laughs> Pretty hot. I wouldn't pay for that. I'd drive myself. <laughs> I mean, because you're already having to buy a, an expensive vehicle. taxi and have it make money for you what do you mean when I'm not when I don't need it then it goes off and drives itself around and that's the plan no, well, I would just use a robo taxi <laughs> and not have a car then because I don't want other people in my car <laughs> yeah, me neither. you can limit it to friends and family though I mean again that's the what they say that might yeah. be a possibility I mean, I guess if you did it like that, then um, then you could share the cost of the vehicle, right? <clears throat> In 1,000 feet, take the Florida Road exit on the right toward Virginia 638 Rolling Road. What is that? This is forward collision warning, but there's nothing there, and it's not stopping. <laughs> so, I saw that once before. But we're on navigating on autopilot though, so, I don't know. Right. That's interesting, they're showing the lines different. Because that's the old, that's like the production code. Oh, okay. Now we're back on In full self-driving. Turn right onto the road. It's interesting that they don't show dashed lines. I'd like to see dashed yeah. lines. Now turn right onto Bardo Road. Yeah, I mean, I guess if it were a, a, a thing where, you know, if the car could... Look, it's, oh, it's, it's a red arrow. But, oh, okay, yeah. I have a student driver behind us. I've been thinking about getting a student driver sticker for this car. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, if Kimberly and I only needed one vehicle because the car would take me to work, you know, because I usually go to work earlier than she does, so if it'd take me to work, drop me off, go back and pick her up, and then when I got ready to leave get out of work, this lane, get out of this lane, oh, come on, and then when I got ready to go home, it would take me home and then go back and pick her up, I mean, but it's using, it's going more trips, a lot more trips that way so I, I should have just let it there was nobody else around I should have just let it go straight and just reported it so I didn't have to intervene but oh well yeah who knows what will happen 
trade her truck for a cyber truck and yeah, I don't think she's gonna <laughs> The, the nav has now it turned turn left, left, so it actually got into the right lane. Now, move the car. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're here. We're here. We made it. 